We're just traveling from New York to Los Angeles to California. And just yeah. literally moments, yeah, just like this, pulling up, talking to people, seeing what people are thinking. My auntie Dory married a GI in the Second World War. They lived the American dream. I was 10 when I first came here. They had a swimming pool. I'd never seen a house with a swimming pool in my life. It was America. I loved it. I loved it. I first came to America, I was 12 years old, went to Hollywood. My mother took me to see Ike and Tina Turner. There were all these women that came out and they were shaking their booty. And I was very um, enlivened. How do you feel about where America's heading? You think things are going to change in America? Have you ever met Colonel Sanders? I've always loved this place, really, but I, I don't know, I'm just not sure where it's headed at the moment. And, I mean, frankly, I'm not sure many Americans do either. Uh, chaps. Yeah. There's a gun show across the road. Where are you from? I'm from England. Oh, f sick. I mean, this I'd is like the Wild West here, man. Everybody. It's different. I was overseas for about four years, supporting a war on terrorism. Come back to the United States, it's changed a lot. The economy, how am I going to find a job? <clears throat> Working for the Mafia? What do you think America's biggest problem is these days? We want to get out from underneath the oil. Start thinking. America is the land of opportunity. For some of us, the opportunity comes a lot easier than others. The world isn't just a city you live in. You know, the things you do here, in some way affects somebody else in another part of the country, another part of the world. The heart of the people is good. Oh my God, look at that cross. If America was a person, would you say that America in the last two or 300 years had been a good Christian? What's great about America? Beer. Beer's good. What do you think would make America a better place? Forget about money and greed and power. America's gonna be here, man. You know, nothing else will get some duct tape. Oh, hey, let's go.